Hi, this is Frank Furness, and welcome to Tools and Tips, where I'll be discussing and showing you all kinds of tools you can use with regard to internet technology, websites, e-marketing, developing products. Also, take a look at my website, www.frankfurness.com, or drop me an email, frank at frankfurness.com. Remember to download my free internet ebook, and in that there'll be all kinds of tips and ideas, tools that you can download from the internet, tools that I've actually tried out that you can buy and use for various things. That's yours for free, www.frankfurness.com forward slash internet CFM. Well, let's get started. Have you ever watched some presentations and they've got some great video clips playing there? Well, I'm going to show you right now how we add video clips. The first thing you've got to do is you've got to find the video clips. And I believe you can download some from the internet or you can create your own using some of your own files, uh, some great programs. I use Pinnacle Pro to create some of my files and I just keep them all in a folder called videos. So what I've done is I've got all of these video clips and I want to put one into a PowerPoint presentation. So I'd now click insert movies and sounds and I'm going to go into movie from file. And let's have a look at the various videos I've got here. And I've got huge amounts of videos over here. There's a nice little one called Booker. And I would click on that, go OK. And it's going to ask me if I want to put that in automatically. There it's going to come up now. It's going to say, do you, there you go, do you want your movie to play automatically in the slideshow? If not, it'll play when you click it. So you've got the choice of either as soon as that slide opens, it starts playing, or it'll open when you click it. So I'm going to say I want it to play automatically. Go, yes. Now that looks a little bit small to me. What do you do? You grab the corners, pull the corners down a little bit, and stretch it. Now that looks pretty good, but I always like to have a black background. So what I'll do is you click anywhere on the slide, uh, right click go into background and I like to have a black background go yes and apply only to that slide so there we go that looks good if I now move down and I go into start the slideshow there we go and there we've got our video clip as you can see it's all coming alive there and it's great you can add some really funny video clips in you can add some serious stuff in but think about it if it's your company uh, you can have interviews with happy clients. Uh, you can have some of your products. You can video almost anything, put it into your PowerPoint presentation or using Camtasia, make a clip of it and send it to some of your clients. So another great addition is uh, putting in video clips.